Hey guys, welcome to my no heat curls tutorial. This tutorial will show you how to do pin curls all over your head and have nice bouncy curls in the morning. I've already started by brushing out my hair and making sure that there aren't any tangles. I've pre-teased the crown of my head, but this style works best with second day hair without hairspray. I'm using a clip to separate my hair, about a thousand bobby pins, water to dampen my hair, and parting my hair into three sections. I'm just tying away the bottom section of my hair and splitting the top section into additional two sections. I'll be taking approximately one inch sections of hair because I like my curls to be tightish, but not too tight. Spritz your hair with water or a leave-in conditioner, and at this point it's also a good idea to apply any mousse or some kind of styling product if you need extra hold or if your hair is too clean. I'm taking two fingers and wrapping my hair around them loosely so it's easier to slide your fingers out. Now you want to make sure that you have the ends of your hair secured and secure them to your head with bobby pins. I like to use two bobby pins and have them crisscrossed, um, forming an X to give them a more secure hold while you're sleeping at night. Now depending on the type of curl you want, you'll want smaller sections for tighter curls and larger sections for looser waves. Continue wrapping sections around your fingers and securing them to your head with bobby pins until you run out of hair to curl. I'm just going to speed this up so you can see what the rest of my head looks like finished. So when you wake up and take out all of your bobby pins, you'll want to start separating your curls so it doesn't look so strange. This way it makes the curls a lot bigger and bouncier and gives your hair a lot more volume. I also like to fluff out the roots of my hair with my fingers so all of my hair isn't sticking straight to my scalp. The next step that I like to do is use hairspray, spray it onto the end of a comb and I just kind of puff up my little crown area since it's gotten a little bit flat from sleeping on it. You can go ahead and tease your hair but you might make some of your curls a bit frizzy so that's why I pre-tease it ahead of time. If your curls are really tight, what I like to do is spray my hands with water or use a leave-in conditioner and start pulling on my curls gently and twisting the curls around my fingers just to make sure I don't straighten the hair. And also so I have the curls a little bit more defined. Now some of you may not want to use water because it can make your hair frizzy. It doesn't really do that to my hair, uh, but another option is to use smoothing serum and rake your hands through your curls so it makes your hair shiny, but also separates your curls and minimizes the frizz. So keep playing around with your curls until you're happy with them. This method again uses no heat and gives me a lot of volume, and I also don't really have to put a lot of effort into my hair the next morning. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and as always, feel free to comment, thumbs up, and subscribe if you like this. Hope you guys are having an awesome day, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!